Hi friends, John Laspini here talking about visceral fat. What is the difference between visceral fat and subcutaneous fat? Subcutaneous fat is the stuff that jiggles, that you can grab. Like I can, let me show you in the camera, I can grab my subcutaneous fat. I got a little chunk of it here. That's subcutaneous and it's okay to have a little bit of subcutaneous fat. People who are very, very low in body fat percentage, very, very skinny, that's not that healthy. Even though visually it looks nice to people to be that lean, it's not as healthy as having a little bit of subcutaneous fat. In this video, I wanna talk about the fat that is dangerous and that's called visceral fat. It surrounds your internal organs like your liver, your intestines, your stomach. It could be on any organ or in the organ. It's sometimes called active fat or toxic fat. Too much visceral fat can lead to serious health issues like diabetes, heart disease, stroke, and dementia. You can get an MRI or a DEXA scan, and you can see how much visceral fat you have, but you can also estimate it with a tape measure around your waist. Exercise for at least 30 minutes a day and maintain a healthy, active, low-stress lifestyle and eat the proper human diet to keep your visceral fat as low as possible. While some visceral fat is healthy and normal, too much can be dangerous. Visceral fat can produce toxic chemicals and hormones that can harm your health. They're called cytokines. It can also increase your risk of other health problems by increasing insulin resistance, raising blood pressure, increasing blood sugar levels and triglyceride levels and lowering levels of HDL, which we wanna have as high in HDL as possible, high density lipoprotein. You can't see visceral fat, but it's usually associated with having more abdominal fat, because if you have a lot of visceral fat, it's gonna push out your stomach. And whether it's the jiggly fat on the outside that you feel, the visceral fat on the inside is pushing out. If you've ever seen a lot of these guys in their 40s and 50s walking around with bellies. They almost look pregnant. They have a lot of visceral fat pushing their bellies out. It's so unhealthy. You wanna have a healthy waist size and that's important for good health. That means you have a low visceral fat. So in conclusion, visceral fat is the fat in and on and around deep inside your organs and that is unhealthy to have a lot of that. You want just a tiny bit of that. The other fat is called subcutaneous fat that you can pinch and grab. And you don't want too much of that because that's unsightly, but a little bit of that, a moderate amount of that is actually okay and healthy. And that does not secrete toxic chemicals like visceral fat does. Ladies and gentlemen, if you liked this explanation of what visceral fat is, click the thumbs up and share and subscribe and uh, you know let other people know to tune into my channel to learn little bits and nuggets of information that I learn and pass on to you. Have a great day.